natin naman ngayong re-reviewin ay about multiplying and dividing integers. In multiplying, dividing integers with the same sign, the product quotient will be positive. Example, positive 4 times positive 5 equals positive 20. Pareha sila positive sign. So, the answer is positive. Pag parehas naman negative, let's say negative 4 times negative 5, the answer is positive 20. The same sign pa rin. Kaya ang sagot, positive. So, ganun din sa division or sa dividing integers. 24 divided by 12 equals 2 or positive 24 divided by 12 equals positive 2. Negative 16 divided by negative 4 equals positive 4. So, dividing the same sign, the answer is positive. Dito naman tayo sa multiplying, dividing integers with different sign. The product quotient will be negative. Example, negative 5 times positive 4, the answer is negative 20 or negative 4 times 5 the answer is negative 20 in division sa, div sa dividing integers naman with different sign 30 divided by negative 6 the answer is negative 5 or 40 negative 45 Divided by 9, the answer is negative 5. So, dividing, multiplying integers with different sign, the product or quotient will be negative. Okay, more example. Negative 5 times 4 divided by negative 2. So, sagutan muna natin ito. Negative times positive. The answer is negative. Negative 20. Then divided by negative 2. The answer is the same sign. So, ang sagot is positive. Positive 10. Okay, number 2. Positive 6 divided by positive 2. So, the answer is positive 3. Times negative 7. The answer is Different sign, so ang sagot ay negative. Negative 21. Okay, dito naman, the same sign, so ang sagot is positive. 10 divided by 5, the answer is 2. Positive 2. Times negative 6, different sign, the answer is negative. 2 times 6, the answer is 12. Negative 12. Okay, dito naman. Different sign. So, 9 times, 7, 9 times 8, 72. Different sign, kaya negative 72. Then, divide negative 12. Same sign na sila. Magkaparehas na ng sign. So, the answer is positive. 72 divided by 12. The answer is positive 6. Okay, more example. Sa example naman na ito ay ginamit natin ang parenthesis as a symbol of multiplication. At sa division naman, ginamit natin yung fraction bar. Okay, number 1, 3 times negative 4. So, different sila. Ang sagot dyan ay 
negative negative 12 times negative 2 divided by negative 8 so positive, uh, negative 12 times negative 2 the answer is positive positive 24 divided by negative 8 the answer is negative 3 Different sign kasi sila. Positive 24, negative 8. So, the answer is negative 3. Okay, dito naman sa number 2. Negative 5 times negative 4. The same sila. So, ang answer is positive 20 times negative 2. Divided by negative 8 times positive 5. So, different sign. Ang sagot is negative 40. So, 20 times negative 2, different sign. The answer is negative. So, negative 40 divided by negative 40. So, dito, the same sign. Negative divided by negative. So, negative 40 divided by negative 40. The answer is positive 1 Okay, ang susunod na ating example ay inyo munang sasagutan at pagkatapos bago natin i-reveal yung aking sagot Okay, 5 minutes ang ibibigay ko sa inyo para masagutan ang mga susunod na example Post muna at sagutan bago natin i-reveal yung answer. Okay, sagutan na natin. Number 1, positive 3 times negative 4 times negative 2 divided by negative 6. Okay, ne positive 3 times negative 4, different sign. The answer is negative 12 times negative 2 divided by negative 6. So, the same sign na yung negative 12 at negative 2. So, the answer is positive 24 divided by negative 6. Different sign. The answer is negative 4. Okay, dito tayo sa number 2. Sa number 2, mayroong exponent. Negative 2 square. Ang ibig sabihin niyan is negative 2 times negative 2. So, ang unahin muna natin is yung nasa 
parenthesis na may exponent. Negative 2 times negative 2 is positive 4. Times sa positive 4, then positive 3. Then divided by 12. Dahil yan ay lahat ay positive na 4 times 4 times 3. 4 times 4, 16 times 3 is 48. Positive 48 divided by negative 12. Different sign, kaya ang sagot is negative. Negative 4. So, dito naman sa number 3. Negative 3 cubed times 2 squared. So, yung ibig sabihin nitong negative 3 raised to the power of 3. Negative 3 times negative 3 times negative 3. Ito namang 2 squared is 2 times 2. So, if we multiply na, ito muna, negative times negative, positive 9. Kasi, same sign, so positive 9. Then, multiply sa negative 3, the answer is negative, negative 27. Then, i-multiply sa 4, dahil ito ay 4, negative 27 times 4 is negative 108. Okay. Salamat sa inyong uh, muling panunood ng ating uh, review. Kung hindi pa kayo subscriber ng aking channel, mag-subscribe na kayo at i-click nyo ang notification bell para updated kayo sa aking mga bagong upload na review. Free tutorial ko yan sa inyo na mga nasa uh, grade 5 and 6 up to 7. Lalo na ngayon na online ang ating uh, pag-aaral. Maraming salamat. See you in my next video.